What's going on everybody? It's LSU Maniac coming back at you for another little break. And today we're going to be taking a look at a new release from Panini. And this is 2022 Panini Prism Draft Picks. Pretty cool set right here that's not going to break the bank, y'all. You can pick these up for around $100, maybe just a little bit more. Five packs in this box. But you're getting five autographs in this box. So pretty cool there. It's been like this for quite a while. They do have some ultra rares, if you can see that. we got the Lava Flow Color Blast. Those are pretty tough pulls, maybe one per case. Five silver prisms and three numbered parallels. So you'll get three numbered cards in this uh, box. Plus five silvers to go along with it. So, draft picks. It's not a set that's going to break any records for selling the values on them are not extremely crazy, but you pull the right guys and it will sell for some decent money. And like I said, it's only a hundred dollars. So you're paying a hundred dollars for five autographs on the front. My boy straight out of LSU, Jacob Berry. Hopefully he can get his defense going. The dude's got an extremely, extremely nice bat. Just lacks defense and Brooks Lee right there for the twins. Pretty cool box. It's been like this every year. They kind of just lay loose in there, though. Not a ton of cards in this box, as you can see. Just five little packs. But you do get them five autos. Now, guys, I was looking over the checklist. The autograph checklist is absolutely massive. They got a few different subsets, some insert autographs you can pull. But the regular draft pick autograph set is 220 cards. You also have veteran prospects in here. I say veterans, but Noel V. Marte, Jackson Churio, uh, Jason Dominguez, Adley Rushman. A lot of uh, a lot of guys signed in this class. The only problem is trying to get them. I don't know where the auto is, but we're just going to roll through it, guys. And it's got that same Panini prism look. Pretty similar year to year. Will Frisch. The only downside to this set, it shows them, I say it's a downside, it's not really a downside. It shows them in their college or high school uniforms. There's a look at the back. You don't really see any stats. Gives you a little write up. Will Frisch from Oregon State. Dominic Keegan. And it is a 220 card checklist. So each player in this set is going to have an auto, is the way it seems. Parker Misik. Now flip. Here's our first prism right here Tyler Schweitzer. Schweitzer. And a Danny Soretti. North Carolina. Tar Heel. Is this our auto? That's going to be our auto. We'll move these to the front. Big, uh, nice looking insert there. Power surge. Big power hitter, Kevin Parada. Clark Elliott. Thunderstruck insert. And let's check this out. I see a bat in his hand. Who is that? Edwin Arroyo. So, like I said, there's one of your, I guess you could call it, prospect uh, veterans. Shortstop, don't really give you any, uh, nothing too much on the back. But a nice looking card, man. Edwin Arroyo, up and coming prospect. And this Danny Soretti, that one was not numbered from the North Carolina Tar Heels. So pack number one, we pulled us a vet. Not really a vet, but not one of the new draft picks. But yeah, it's going to be hard, guys, to to pull the big-time guys because of the big, big checklist. Panini has always been like that. Walter Ford. There's a Brooks Lee, the cover boy. We'll take it. Logan Tanner. Prism. There we go. That ain't bad. How about a Jace Young? Very nice card right here. Another blue mojo. Just things is going to be our auto next. We got a Walter Ford again. Thunderstruck. 
power surge. Colby Thomas. So it looks like we got some color right here. Come on, let's get us a big name. We got another batter here. It doesn't look familiar. Joe Lamp. Our Lamp A. 17 of 50. Arizona State. I wish it would tell you on here which uh, round and what pick they was. If they would just add a little bit more information, it would be nice. But two position players, I'll take it. And a very nice Jace Young here. That is not numbered, but still a really nice card. I'm not going to complain with that. All right, three autos to go. Three packs. I'm going to just... Uh, Ooh, look like we got some gold back there, guys. Nick Voigt. Jared McKenzie. I guess they all going this way now. Cade Horton. Cade Hunter Prism. And a Trey Faltine. Felting. What is this gold right here? It is a pitcher. Cooper Zerpy. Three of ten. Super low numbered. Nice looking card. Not really the name we were looking for. Then we got a Jordan Beck. Boy, that Tennessee Volunteers team last year was so dominant and just couldn't. I don't even th know. They didn't make it to the uh, College World Series. All right, we got a signing session. So our third different subset and our first pitcher of the day is going to be a Brooks Goswing. Brooks Goswing. That looks to be a silver, not numbered. Chicago. And they are sticker autos, so no on-card ink will be in this set. But like I said, not going to break the bank at all. There's Wilman Diaz. He's been around a little while. Logan Wagner. Cam Collier. Our next prism is Ryan Jennings. Red of Jared McKenzie. The next one's going to be our auto. We got a brilliance of Hunter Barco. And another color, it looks like, Tristan Verling. From Gonzaga. That's a nice looking card. 21 to 23. So both of our colors so far has been pitchers. Never heard of that guy there. And let's see our next auto. Two more autos in this box, y'all. And the pitchers are starting to roll in. Somebody I've never heard of again. Carson Milbrandt. From high school. 96 mile an hour. Maybe he's somebody. All right, one to go, y'all. Yeah, it's very, very tough to get them big time names. It's just such a big checklist. All right, last pack. Here we go. Look at that last name, huh? Hand Sulker. Tidwell. We got a red right out in front of us. In the wrong spot, Chase DeLauder. James Madison University. This one here is going to be 50 out of 50. So three position players. I'm not going to complain with that. Gabriel Hughes, Rio Prism. Blue of Carson Weissenhunt. Uh oh, check this out, guys. A little back-to-back -back, uh, extra auto right here. Two numbered autos at that. Trey Faltine from Texas. Don't know a ton about him, but I'll definitely take it, man. A little extra auto to go with it. Then we got a Tiger Stripe. Jacob Melton. And that one there is 5, uh, five of 99. So, man, I got us a bonus auto in this box. 
pretty cool not gonna complain so guys there's a look at it 2022 panini prism draft picks i'm curious to hear y'all's thoughts on it did y'all well go out and buy any they usually got retail of this you can pick up that might guarantee an auto per box something like that but there it is y'all we got some boom boxes in the looks uh near future and not a ton of stuff still still waiting on a lot of stuff to be uh released y'all but uh, thanks as always, guys. If y'all don't mind, please leave me a thumbs up, and I'll see y'all on the next one. LSU Maniac out of here.